Wikipedia is the free internet encyclopedia that anyone can edit. Wikipedia gave me an outlet to uh, feel like I was contributing to something really important. I'm Dr. Skylar Kovic, a user academic challenger. I've been a Wikipedian since 2003. I'm really impressed with where Wikipedia is at right now with its uh, level of content. And you know, tens of thousands of people have worked so hard to build this up. And uh, when I say happy birthday to Wikipedia, 20 years of great work and many, many more. This is Dr. Mel Gannis from Wiki SoCal, Wiki Blind. I've been a Wikipedian since 2004, and I am so proud to be part of this movement, to be part of the future of human knowledge and how we are creating this incredible set of resources for the world. Happy birthday to everyone here. Thank you for all of the hours and intense energy it has taken to build this amazing product, this amazing project. I'm Fiona. I really want to help with Wikipedia so that everyone can get their correct information. And so it becomes a more reliable source. How did you get started helping with Wikipedia? I've been totally blind since birth. I was born in 1987. Uh, I have uh, Libra's congenital amaurosis. Uh, I started in Wikipedia when I was in high school, uh, edited a lot throughout high school and college. And now I have a doctorate in political science. I earned from UC Santa Barbara in 2017. And almost all of that was done using the job access with speech software. I became an administrator. And then throughout the 2000s, like th throughout the whole time I was in high school and in college, I was really involved in uh, writing articles. I, I, I've written about a thousand articles or, or like the, the initial content for a thousand articles, uh, edited a lot to, to improve articles, and uh, also was involved in uh, reverting vandalism, uh, deleting junk pages where, where people try to, to make articles about their friends or their, their high school band or, or that sort of thing. Uh, it's, there's criteria where articles like that could be deleted immediately. Uh, it, it's not as easy to create a new article as it used to be. Uh, for either good or bad articles. We've been on Wikipedia for a long time. Wow. <laughs> That's right. What are you doing with Wikipedia and Wikiblind now? What we would like to do is to provide trainings so that blind people can uh, start editing, uh, not only Wikipedia, but other wiki projects as well. There's an effort to uh, get Wikimedia Foundation to make it so people can provide feedback on articles, even if they don't have time or expertise to edit them. I am especially interested in just the publicity, you know, spreading the word about uh, uh, blind people in the free knowledge movement and uh, uh, providing some trainings to anyone who's interested. What are your hopes for the future of human knowledge? Uh, we've come a long way in, in the past 20 years. Uh, it is possible uh, to find information, you know, the, the, the basic facts and even a lot of theories <laughs> about many of the important people throughout the world, uh, you know, whether it's a world leader or a musician or someone from the past, also get people to expand their horizons more and realize that there's so much that they don't know. And no, no, nobody's going to be able to know everything. That, that's not what we're asking, but, but we want people to be well-rounded and realize what it what a diverse, big world that is out there. I'm a new Wikipedian and member of Wikiblind, so what should I learn to do? Yeah, it's a good question. Uh, it, it really depends on your specific interests, but I think it is also good to, from the content perspective, uh, to know where you think Wikipedia is lacking and uh, what areas you think could be improved. Maybe finding new references to add, correcting typing issues, uh, maybe talking with people on the talk page to try to uh, get a consensus if people are disagreeing about what to be in the article. Uh, there, there are so many opportunities out there in the community. And uh, so yeah, trying just looking at some articles and trying to figure out for yourself where that is for you. There's really so much to, to uh, look into. And it, it's not all about the really uh, controversial or political stuff. It, you know, there's 
so much about art and music, which are about people expressing themselves. The journey and the struggles and the the meaningfulness. Why is it so important to contribute to Wikipedia? In the year or so after I started contributing, all of a sudden it got a huge amount of media attention, like from the New York Times. And it started to feel that I was a part of something really big. Any Topics Wikipedia article is going to be the way that many people around the world are going to understand it. And that's a big responsibility uh, to be able to make that article the best that it can be. And hopefully you can meet very good people along the way who are working on that with you. Now, when I was a teenager, I also got caught up in the adrenaline of the, uh, you know, some of the uh, dispute resolution things, uh, reverting vandalism, deleting junk pages. It was almost like a, you know, an outlet for, for relieving stress, you know, the way that some people would play video games uh, or you know, all kinds of other things that people do to relieve stress. What do you want to be doing um, in, this, in these coming years with Wikiblind and just your activism and, and your own worlds? Hoping to uh, be a mentor to other blind people who are interested in contributing. I definitely hope to, to continue to improve articles myself and uh, to be an advocate uh, for, uh, for accessibility, to uh, get more involved with relations with the Mid Wikimedia Foundation that runs the site to make some, some uh, accessibility improvements. We wanna hear more from people who are more involved on the ground right now in, uh, in Wikipedia as well. Do you have any favorite stories from your journey through the Wikipedia stuff, like a particular story that really stuck with you? Uh, yeah, yeah, there are a lot. But one of my favorites was Prime Minister of Mongolia back in 2006. Uh, there were two editors who were uh, editing his article and one wanted to add really to paint him in a really positive light as much as possible. And one wanted to paint him in a really negative light. Uh, so I was a freshman in college, uh, you know, major in political science, and didn't really have any particular expertise about Mongolia, but I was able to uh, come up with a version that was relatively acceptable to both editors, and also calm them down a bit. They, they, were, they were each accusing each other of being uh, on the opposite side of the of, of the Mongolian government, one one even said that the other was actually the son of the person being edited, but had no evidence for that. Uh, so there were a few times when I stepped into things like that, and now looking back, I I wonder, you know, I, I'm surprised that they accepted my input, you know, given like I had no real expertise on Mongolia. Uh, I, the, the one person said. Uh, you know that you're so uh, intent on the facts, like, like making sure the facts are right, like who was in power when and who's not, but you haven't actually looked at what they've actually done with their power. And that, that, was, a really, that, that was a really interesting insight that I, has kept with me uh, as I've moved on with, you know, gone into academia and uh, continue with a, a, lot of, a lot of my work. Working with the American Foundation for the Blind and uh, various lighthouse groups and others to spread the word that uh, Wikipedia is accessible to the blind, but there are some things that we would like for the foundation to do to make things even more accessible. A AFB has uh, been great to partner with. The, uh, they, they run the Helen Keller archives, and it'll be interesting to see if there's more we can contribute from there, I think Helen Keller has a pretty large article already, but uh, there's definitely more that could be said about her and some of the other people who were in her life or uh, were involved in in her work or in the in the generations before hers and after hers. That content partnership will be good, and we we look forward to AFB uh, spreading the word about us so that people people can come to us and uh, learn more. Really impressed with AFB's uh, priorities on uh, employment and education for the blind and uh, assistance with, with people who have vision loss, uh, you know, maybe at, at a different times in their lives. And uh, yeah, look, 
We look forward to continuing to work with them. Happy birthday, Wikipedia. My name is Ben Fox, and I love the free information that you bring, and I'm a big fan of Wikiblind. Here's to 20 more years and 100 more after that. Happy birthday, Wikipedians. We're looking forward to celebrating another 20 years with you in Wiki Wonderland. Happy birthday, Wikipedia. We're celebrating 20 years in Wiki Wonderland. Happy birthday to Wikipedia, celebrating 20 years in Wiki Wonderland.